What we've found is that chronic intake of processed foods high in advanced glycation end products, which are generated by a heat treatment, lead to remodeling of the gut microbiota and increased intestinal permeability, which is known as a leaky gut. And so this allows mediators to translocate from the gut into the bloodstream where they can activate the complement pathway, which is part of the innate immune system. And this causes an inflammatory response. In particular, we see generation of complement C5A, which is a potent pro-inflammatory molecule. And we found that this C5A leads to kidney injury. And now there are three ways to block this pathway at different sites to restore kidney health. Firstly, we can block advanced glycation end products. And here we have used an AGE inhibitor known as allergebrium chloride. The second way to block this pathway is to use a dietary approach. And in this case, we've used a rescue diet, which has been modified with a specialized fiber called resistant starch. And this resistant starch is resistant to digestion and makes its way down into the large bowel where it is fermented by the gut bacteria. And substances produced by the beneficial gut bacteria are anti-inflammatory and inhibit complement, thereby improving kidney injury. And the final way that we can block this pathway is via directly inhibiting the C5A receptor. And so we've inhibited signaling of the C5A receptor using a novel compound called PMX53. This reduces inflammation and restores the health of the kidney.